securing San Diego's spot in the biotech industry. Yeah, we know our county is a hub for biotech innovation. Well, now another company is adding some new developments. For an in-depth conversation about this, we've invited Christian Henry. He's the CEO at PacBio. Christian, thank you very much for joining us this morning. Thank you very much. It's great to be here. Now, a lot of people in San Diego know about some of the big companies in biotech. Uh, tell us a little bit about your company because you're kind of the new kid on the block, if you will. Sure. PacBio is a uh, sequencing company that has the leading long and short read sequencing technologies. Uh, we've been around for a while, but we've been in San Diego only for about a year. We uh, acquired a company in 2021 that gave us the opportunity to come to San Diego. So Christian, let's talk a little bit about some of uh, the new products that you're offering. Can you, can you explain to folks what they are and why this is so exciting? Sure, uh, two weeks ago we announced two new products. The first product we call Revio is a DNA sequencer. And really what that is, is it's a, an instrument that allows scientists to read the, your DNA and see all the different letters. And our long read sequencer called Revio allows you to see very long pieces of that DNA, which allows researchers to have a much more complete view of the genome. The second product we announced is called Onso, and Onso is a short read, so it reads shorter fragments of DNA, but allows the Onso product allows researchers to look much deeper into, into the cells to find those rare fragments of DNA that might signal uh, cancer or, or other kinds of diseases. And so we're super excited to have both products coming to market around the same time. Is this the kind of thing that's just for like researchers and scientists to work on? Or is this something that might be beneficial for an everyday person like me or some of our viewers at home to say, hey, I want my genome sequence. How could that benefit me? Well, I think it's for, it really is a global uh, technology. In fact, our sequencers are used in agriculture, in research, in uh, even in diagnostic uh, uses, and really it's clinical diagnostic research is what's happening right now. For example, someone with uh, maybe a rare disease might wanna have their genome sequenced so they could understand uh, what potentially the culprit of that disease could be, or even uh, you know, direct to consumers. So someone like yourself wanting to learn a little bit more about your, your ancestry or, or perhaps what you might have predispositions for could use this technology. Yeah, incredible. Something that we couldn't have even considered maybe even a generation ago. Christian Henry, PacBio CEO, thank you so much. We appreciate all this new info. Thank you, I appreciate it.